comedy, but I gave up in the end. To be honest, I'm not a great lover of feet. What? Smelly feet? Well, any kind of feet. <laughs> they look so stupid, flapping around at the end of your legs. And all that hard skin. Oh, I know, you should see this. <laughs> and when it goes all yellow. <laughs> all right, all right. We're getting a complex. <laughs> <laughs> so, will you put me in for a few aromatherapy sessions? Sure, whenever. Susie, what's your number? 701-645. Susie, uh, in between chiding for business for your beauty parlour empire, can I remind you you're here to work? Work's what I've been doing all evening. How is it the table number one is still waiting for dessert? They wanted a rest between courses. And the only other satisfied customer is the person you've been canoodling with all night. You've got some nerve. <coughs> oh! My God! Oh, Faye, sorry, really. I do apologise. Don't just apologise. Do something. It'll wash out, I'm sure. Uh, we'll pay for the dry cleaning, of course. I, I can't apologise enough. Uh, another bottle of wine, Susie. Uh, on the house, of course. <laughs> You'll pay for that, along with the dry cleaning. It was an accident. Well, it'll teach you to be more careful in future, won't it? Oh, shut your face. I've been insulted by better men than you, you amateur. Get in the kitchen. That's enough. For once, Eric, I agree. Stuff your poxy job. I'd rather die in the gutter than carry on slaving for you. Come on, Zoe. And what about your bill? Take it out of my wages. Never mind her bill. What about my jeans? What about this table? Uh, well, don't just stand there gawping. Mop it up. I can smell something burning. You do it. 